Hey guys, Shea Bear 1000 here. Let's walk across this bridge. Somebody rammed it. Must have been in a Dodge. <laughs> Pretty cool, huh? Neat. Okay, guys. We're at the old 129 bridge. An old abandoned bridge. There's something on the way out. I want to get for you that's right there right to the right of the road but we'll get to that it's pretty cool so there's people down here kayaking and canoeing this one is uh, heavily graffitied I think this closed in 1974, 1973 ish. And we're going to walk down that way a little bit. But. Wow. That's cool. There. Isn't that cool? Got people having a great time out here. I'll take you over here on the other side. Good day for that. Awesome. Really cool. Having a good time. And that's the new bridge yeah, out there. more of this. That's where we parked. I should climb up there and get some footage. Graffiti. And we're going to take a walk down this way. There used to be another bridge down there, but it's gone. See, so it's similar to the other one, but it's higher. She's using my phone. I got her hooked up with a good mic, so her video will come out decent. Hmm. She said somebody put a lock on. We'll go back and check it out. I just want to show you this. So the bridge doesn't actually just stop right here at the expansion joint it actually goes a little farther down that way somebody spent some time on that ah, she said somebody put a lock up here so Yeah, they did. Pretty cool. Huh. Good eye, monkey. Jamie loves Janice. They might start a fad. Uh, there's a couple more locks down here, as a matter of fact. 
Oh yeah. Honey, you see this? Isn't that cool? So somebody's started a fad it looks like. I think there was a what was it there was a bridge over is it England that they do that too and got a lot of uh, a lot of locks on it. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. So I'm gonna take you for a walk down this way. Like I said, there's it, it dead ends to where there used to be another bridge, but it's torn down now. So, uh, so I'll keep you rolling. We'll walk down through here. Kevin Whitlock, mm -hmm. 922.74 to 418.18. Hmm. Uh -huh. So they must have did this like as a memorial for him. Uh-huh. Would be my guess. Maybe. Pretty cool. There's a hole down through there. See that? So See, we're kind of still on a bridge here. There's a long bridge there. Another expansion joint. Love these water oaks. Let's see, there's a the trail down there. It goes back in there. It's still a good ways up, probably 15 feet, maybe 20, 15 probably, 15 feet up right now. We're coming to the end of the bridge. I'll turn you around here and I'll get you another shot of the bridge there. Pretty neat. Yeah, pretty neat. So, and we are at the end of the bridge, or beginning, depending on which side you're coming from. See, there's the trails back through there, but I'm guessing that's uh, that's a, some kind of park over there uh, where I showed you the stonework. We may drive over there and check that out as well. Mm -hmm. This must have been. Got the Ninja Turtles there. Where it ended, huh? they call that thing right there? What? That hole is there. Culvert? Yeah. Pipe? Pipe? It's for drainage. Of course it's not working anymore. That's why this is all came out through here. Alright, so we're gonna keep walking down this way. And uh, I'll turn you back on when we get to the uh, other bridge. Okay. An old road turns off down here. I don't know where that would have went. Down to the river, right? 
so we'll walk it on the way back. But for right now, we're going to keep going this way. Well, I guess I probably could have kept you rolling. I didn't know how far this was. There's a little road through there. old sign that says bridge closed or used to say bridge closed so somebody's been four wheeling up through here okay, we're at the end now. see it's for four wheel drive somebody's been four wheeling up through here so we're kind of can't go any farther. You come up this way. Oh, here we can. We can get through here. It does go farther. Okay. <clears throat> okay. Oh, it does go. Oh, shit. I bumped my head. It does go a ways back through here. So. And it still goes a little further that way, so we're going to keep walking. Here comes Monkey and Bruno. There you are. So is that the other road? It just keeps going. Oh, does it? Yeah. You coming through, or? Do you want to keep going? I'm going to keep going. Are you coming through? I don't know. Okay, so... Apparently my phone ran out of space. The monkeys, she didn't come through the through the thicket there. She's staying back that way towards the bridge, and we're going to keep walking up this way. It's pretty pretty out in here, but like I was telling you in the other video, a lot of people get these two bridges confused. Because they do look alike, but as you can tell, this one is much higher. It goes up like that, and the other one's just flat. Uh, I think they were built about the same time, about uh, 1922, 1925-ish, something like that, if I remember right. So, okay. All right, we're 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 almost to the end of this road here, to where the other bridge, there was a... There used to be a bridge up here, but it's totally gone. But I'm sure we'll see remnants of it. So, I wish she would have came. I'll let her use some of this footage too. So, if they look a lot alike, that's because we're kind of down to... Uh, well, she was using the old, the old camera, the old Sony Handycam, and... Uh, it takes the little discs, the little uh, mini DVDs, and uh, I didn't bring an extra disc. She ran out of disc space. So, um, I didn't bring an extra disc. I got like 10 of them, and I didn't bring one. So, I'll let her use some of this footage. So, here we go, guys. Let me get you turned around here. Right over here. Yeah, there's still some pilings. Pylons, pilings, whatever you want to call them. Right there. Down there in the water is another one. And let me bring you up to the other side here. There you go, and there's the other side. Quite a gorge. Now, I don't know how far that road goes. I didn't Google Earth it. I should have. I'm sure I could get across there with no problem, because there's like a little rock bridge right here that I could have crossed. 
and got up the other side and kept walking but as you can see it goes way back over in there so so that's pretty cool it's it's a hell of a drop but you can see there's there's a trail here where people go down which I'm not going to I don't like to leave monkey by herself when we're out here like this there's people around but I think she'd be all right I just don't like to do that and I'm sure she would have wanted to come but so there's the edge of the bridge so this was an old bridge using the old poles like that the old wooden poles so this bridge was old I'm guessing probably oh god well it would have to be as old as that one right the one we just crossed so and these these stones here these concrete little pillar type things if you see there's a hole here in every one of them they used to have an eyelet and them holes and what they would do the guardrails back in them days was just a cable run through there and that's what them were for that was your guardrail they've got them on both sides there's another one right there a couple of these are probably yeah there's one that fell down there see it right there uh, but that's what they used to use for guardrails just to they would put eyelets in there and them holes and run a cable through it All right, well, let's go get caught back up with Monkey, and uh, I'll turn you back on then. Okay, it sounds like she may be doing some record or recording something, so maybe she's using her phone now. But, awesome places we visited, visited today, guys. Out of breath. So, there's little Bruno walking with her. But, let's take a walk back across here. Isn't that awesome? She's getting in the truck. I don't know if she's getting hot or Bruno's getting hot or both of them's getting hot. I don't know. Yeah, this is uh, really cool. So, that over there I do believe to be Swanee Springs so I think we're gonna I think we can go up here and go that way but we're gonna go check that out and see what else we can see for you but yeah that's uh, very cool it's very nice you know people floating the floating the creek and canoeing and tubing and uh, kayaking that's really cool over there. I just seen somebody swim out that hole. Oh, my camera's fogging. Yeah, somebody just came out of that hole right there, so. All right, let's go check that out, guys. See what that's all about. There's somebody up on that. Thought maybe they were going to dive in. Must not be. All right, let's go check it out. Okay, guys, this is what I wanted to show you here. It's no trespassing private property, so I'm not going to get out. But kind of wanted to show this to you. house right I I guess that must be the chimney there uh, an old house behind it but horses. yeah I'm guessing that's an old house of some sort what's left of it pretty cool huh yeah. there's another one back in there kiosk 
tell us a little bit about the Swanee Springs and bathhouse. So, Swanee Springs was one of Florida's original tourist destinations. The Spring House was probably established around the time of the Civil War. People came from all around the East Coast to partake of the healing spring waters which were rumored to cure everything from gout to marital problems. From the Civil War to the 1920s, the site had a succession of four wooden hotels, a bathhouse, and many private cottages. A special spur, a special spur railroad line was established just to handle the tourists to the springs. The last hotel burned in 1925. Ah. And with the decline of the railroads, the resort faded away. Today the spring house and some private cabins on adjacent property is all that is left of the site. Look. That's where we were, right? Mm, I don't know. So that is pretty cool. Some mineral water. All right, let's go check it out and get healed. <laughs> yes, I'm going to keep rolling. This is pretty cool. Mm -hmm. Very pretty. So there's the bridge we were just at. Can you see it? Mm -hmm. Yep, see there the we were. You get a view of that bridge there. And there's the bridge we were just at. And I was filming over this way, so. Which way you want to go first? Down here. Alright, we're going to go down this way. And then we'll, we'll walk around. We'll see what's all back in that area. Smell the sulfur? I smell it. Sulfur. You don't smell sulfur? Smells like rotten eggs. So, this is cool. This is the springs. And it goes out through into the river. Through there. Yeah. Go underneath that tunnel. Yeah, See there's. That? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. There's the bridge again. Awesome. So this is the spring here. Awesome. Yeah, she did it. All right. Going up these steps. I wanted to go see what this is. Mm, that's interesting. See back at the other bridge yeah. where the the town used to be. Mm -hmm. I was looking for there's uh, what's left of the boiler of an old steam engine. Mm. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Oh, Used to be cool. four hotels here. Wow. Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Oh, I'll bet you this is part of the railroad. Oh, yeah? I'll bet you. Mm. Remember, they had a special railroad. Yeah. I'm betting this is probably old, the old railroad, maybe. I mean, just a guess, but cool. You got cool. some boaters down here. Pretty neat, huh? Yeah. Awesome. There's the steps down to the springs. This is cool.
that's where we came down from there's like steps there it's hard to believe there were four hotels in that picture is one of them wow but the last one burnt down in 1925 what a shame man you know but i bet if you look around you'd find remnants of it somewhere i'm sure you go digging around there so we're just walking up this little trail here monkey wanted to see what's back in here so i said well let's go check it out she said i want to go back there <laughs> didn't you monk uh huh. There's all kinds of trails down here nice in the water. Oh yeah. Right at the water's edge here. Look how fast it goes. Yeah. Oh yeah, it'll, it'll raise up. Wow, so cool. You want a picture? And right there is another device measures when the water gets high how deep it is zoom in on it here for you a little bit there's another one too yep huh. and monkey just pointed out there's another one right beside it there pretty cool Ready? Monkey likes that rock there. Steps right into the water. Walks right into the water. Yeah. Monkey's back here. Oh wow. This is cool. Please don't ask me what it was, but it is cool. I'll have to, uh, what I'll do is I'll look it up and I'll put a link in the description and we'll find out. Hey, you know what? I'll bet this used to be restrooms. Yeah, I'll bet you. Yeah. This used to be restrooms. This is where the, the stall door was. what these were
Yeah, they, Jesus Christ, you scared the shit out of me. <laughs> yeah, these should be resting. There's a sock. Where's the foot? Where's the body? Exactly what these were. Let me get bathrooms? Back. Yep. For they were bathrooms. They were, they were bathrooms. <laughs> oh, uh -huh. Yeah, very. Awesome. Come on, Bruno. <laughs> Bruno's wanting to explore. Just the toilets, or you think there was a shower, kind of? No, I'd say just the toilets. There's Monkey. Hi, Monk. Wave at us. Hey, baby. This is very cool, so I'm sure she'll want to use some of this footage, too. So, awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Here's the Explorer dog. Hi, Bruno. Bruno, Bruno, look up here. Look up here, I want to take your picture. Bruno, hey. He's excited, he's want to go explore. Mm -hmm. Okay, Let's see what else we can find. You were up there. Yep, we were up there. I bet you're right, this trail takes you right to the bridge. Oh, I'm sure it does. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure you can walk us right over to the bridge. <laughs> 